Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Angela. This video is going to be my Kite Baby sleep bag collection. I do have a couple of them that are like floating around because I had to wash them and I actually have a baby wearing one right now. So that'll be at the end of the video, but this is going to be my Kite Baby sleep bag collection. I'd love to do a collection of all of my stuff that I have, but that's just not a realistic or feasible thing. So <laughs> we're just gonna do the sleep bags. If they weren't so pricey, I would have literally all the prints all the time, but that's not the point. We're all outside right now because I have children sleeping in the house and I need them to stay that way. So I'm going to go sneak up to the closet that I have all of the sleep bags in. <laughs> And we're gonna do that and then i'm going to come back out here again i need to keep my children sleeping and i'm going to unbag unbox unbag this for you i'm so excited it's happy mail every time all right so let's sneak on upstairs and i'm going to show you my sleep bag collection that i have so in our upstairs we have this closet with nothing to use to put in it so so it has become the Kite Baby sleep bag closet. <laughs> These are both 6 to 12 months. They're the footy sleepers. I think this one's Sage. No, this one's Sage. And this one's just the Midnight. Those are the only two footy sleepers that I actually have. I also don't remember the exact names of everything, but yeah, we can do the best we can. So... These over here are like the technically small size, these ones. And they are in the 0.5 tog. They have the stream. And they have the horse. They have lots of the horse print. And they have the sage riptide. And then these ones are also in the small size. They are the 1.0 tog. As you can see, got the horse size. We have the steel riptide. We have a stream. This one is honey. <laughs> this is dating myself, it's honey. This one is the sapphire. And emerald. You'll see an emerald surprise at the end of this. I love that color. And these ones are the medium size. So like, originally they said 6 to 18, but... They're calling it medium now. I have some of the medium size in the 0.5 tog, but they are downstairs. That's going to be after this part. You'll see. So yes, we have the elephant in the 1.0 tog for the medium size. This is that sassy, maybe now I'm doubting. Is it sapphire? I don't know. I don't remember now. It's the same color as this one, though. Got the horse. I stocked up on the horse. The horse is my favorite. I have some outfits in the horse too. I actually had my second son come home and take his newborn pictures in this outfit. So I'll put them pictures here. <laughs> okay, so then these are also in the medium, but these are the 2.5 togs. We've got this steel color, the sage. And the giraffe. I like the giraffe. <laughs> In the large size, I don't have very many because I feel like they can regulate their body temperatures a little bit better than when they're little. So, but my oldest loves his sleep bags. So it's like a non-negotiable to him. So these are all in the large size. These first two are in the 0.5 tog. I've got the, I want to say, oh yeah, that's Odin. And then this is daffodil. <laughs> so that's honey. That. This is a honey sleep bag from way back. And this is daffodil from last summer. So yeah, they're they're different. <laughs> they're different. <laughs> it's like that meme. But they're, they're different, I swear. Yeah, this is Daffodil. So then these last two are 
in the large size again, but they're the 2.5 togs, so the heaviest one. I have Stream, again, another one. This is one of my most favorite colors that they've come out with. I really like this year's Robin, but Stream is definitely my favorite. I actually have a bunch of clothes for the kids in this color, but... And then the final sleep bag is this green one. I'd love to say I could remember the color of this, but it came out with the Daffodil and the Stream last year, so I don't, I don't remember. But yeah, that's the final sleep bag that I have. Okay, no, I stand corrected. That's the final sleep bag that I have up here in this closet right now. Now my challenge, if I choose to accept it, which I will, is to gather up the other random sleep bags. Partially is going to have to be done when my kids are awake, but that will be able to be stitched in. So <laughs> let's go find the other sleep bags. So in the large size, in the 1.0 tog, I have this sleep sack walker. Like I said, I have lots of print in the... This one's a little stand up. <laughs> I gotta try and fix that. And this is their new extra large size. 1.0. Walker, also for my biggest boy right now. I really like this print, but I love that one. But I like that one too. Okay, so these are in the medium size, the 6 to 18. And they are all the .5 tog. I have the oat... I have sage, and I have another horse print. Yes, it makes a bunch of horse prints. Tons. The sad part about this one is it's seen way better days. I, I don't remember what directly happened to that, but every time I watch it, it gets worse. And it was stained initially, like with my first I stained it and I didn't know how to fix it then I learned how to fix stains on Kai Baby and it's it is not fixable I can't get rid of this so so this one's not doing the best out of all of the horse prints but so I already unbagged everything I already took everything out it's already all in my lap I actually already filmed this so we're just gonna go ahead and get on into it here real quick. So, I got a few things for all of my kids, which I, I'm okay with, but what I'll talk about first is my newest little baby that's not here yet. He's due in November, so he's going to be a winter baby for sure. So, I got him a cute little hat and cloud. I actually already have a couple, I think gray and a blue, in these little hats, and like they're not super thick. And they're not, definitely not something I'm going to, like, take them outside, take him outside anywhere <laughs> for long periods of time in. Like, to see the horse, um, there's horses, and we have ever we have animals, so. Not going to be an outside hat for more than just, like, in the car going from point A to point B, but I love these little hats, and I had to get another one so that he had a new coming home hat. So this is probably going to be his coming home hat, but... <laughs> The other thing I got for him is a sleep sack. This is an emerald, and as you saw, I do already have emerald in the sleep bag, but sleep sack. I, I know there's sleep bags, but I just call them sleep sacks sometimes. This one is an extra small. As you saw, I didn't have any extra smalls because my kids are just beyond that point, and I, I'm just now having another baby, and they only recently started doing the extra smalls but like I'm glad they do because I kind of have smaller babies sometimes so my newest little babe got a emerald sleep sack I love this color especially for winter and Christmas time it's the perfect color for that and he's going to be born end of November so we'll be knocking right on Christmas <laughs> so for my one-year-old I got him a tank top this is in their robin color that they came out with for spring with for spring I love this color. It's super cute. And he has blue-gray eyes, so depending on what color he wears, kind of, like, highlights the color of his eyes. And, like, his eyes are going to look so pretty in this color. I'm so excited for that. Bo definitely has plenty of tank tops. Grady, for sure, doesn't have that many, so that was why he kind of won the tank top category. <laughs> 
But Bo I actually also got a tank top, technically, because this last thing I'm going to talk about is their new tank top and short set that they came out with very, very recently. It's a pajama set, but, and I mean, I guess it couldn't or it could not be a pajama set. You would probably have to have a girl for that to be the case because the shorts are definitely booty shorts. <laughs> but for sleeping in, they're going to be fine. So I got him this set in the robin color. Yeah, these are little booty shorts, like little booty shorts, but for sleeping in, they're going to be fine for that. So we have an older house. This was built in like the very, 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 very early 1900s. So it's just a little bit warmer upstairs. Like we have air conditioning. We have really good air conditioning downstairs. There's vents upstairs, but it's just, I don't know what it is. It's just an old house thing. It's just hotter upstairs than it is everywhere else. Even if there's vents up there. So he has a hotter bedroom. So at nighttime, it's still a little bit warmer. Not like significantly, but like just like a little bit warmer. So he got the tank top and short set. Definitely not going to be a going out short set. <laughs> Booty shorts, but it's okay. So they both got the robin color and the new baby got cloud and emerald. And yes, also this sleep bag can count towards my actual collection that I just did because as we saw I don't have any in the extra small size yet until now okay those are all my sleep bags that I have this is my newest kite baby haul that I've received that's what I have like I said I have other clothing items for myself and for my children I actually have a number of different things but the stuff that they've outgrown are packed away and the, I, yeah it just what I could do the best I could do <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching my kite baby sleep bag collection video and my little tiny haul from kite baby too <laughs> I hope everybody has a great day until next time